So how do you get to another planet? Well, that's a combination of technology and skill and reading your instrumentation. First of all, technology upgrades. Second grouping all the way to the bottom, drive engine 2 allows you to enter into sail mode. In sail mode, Becca will orbit the planet. How do you go there? Well, the technology already told you, kinda. You have to press your direction controls, like these, that, whatever you have to move around. That's down, that's up, that's S, that's W for me. And your space, which is for jumping or for flying double. Now you're in flight mode. Alt is down. Again, this may be different for you. But keep in mind, all these controls work for sail a little bit differently. First off, to enter sail mode, you have to press forward and space after you've entered flight mode. Enter fly mode, forward, fly more, upwards. And now we go sail mode. Now we have entered the mouse look. With the mouse, you look around, you don't change directions. This is now entering sail mode. You don't waste energy in sail mode. I do waste energy now because I'm actually recharging my batteries, but that's a different thing. What you also need to consider is your various instrumentations. See these things here, all those blobs? These are gravi gravitational pulls towards you. Right now the gas giant is pulling me in. If I let it, it will bend me. And it is bending me away from the sun. The sun and the planet are the two small ones in the center of my instrumentation. The gas giant is on my side and it is actually bending me. If I let it go, you will see that it is actually bending me. And I don't waste any energy right now. Even though my thrusts are going. I'm not wasting energy going there. I can center where I want to go. Let's say I want to go to my planet that's making me where is it where is it where could it possibly be I don't remember I have to find my planet right it is all the way back there that's why I can't find it so let's go W where you look while you're pressing W go away you will waste energy now, I'm not in a good mood. See my instrumentation here? I'm headed right for the gravitational field. I will crash to the planet. Do not crash into the planet. Look away. There you go. Now I will orbit. My center is away from the gravitational pull effect. I'm no longer in danger of going there. I'm still turning though. I'm turning, I'm turning until I... I'm constantly turning because I have two other gravitational effects coming. Still the strongest one is the gas giant pulling me around in orbit, so I have to actually escape it. Look at where you want to go, W. Now the biggest one is the planet below. He will also bend me. See there, and you are being bent. You have to adjust for gravity. Target where you want to go with W and go there. Now we are in a good position. Now we have the drifting, because of course it is. We have still have other effects and orbits to contend with. But we can correct it again with a W. And we're looking a bit ahead. And now the gravitational effect of this planet is centrish. It's moving because again, we have to contend with orbits moving and us being pulled by other bodies. Keep looking where it is. This didn't change where we, we, we were looking. This was stuck there, but we changed. So keep pressing W and that is now corrected as well. You are being pulled. You're not wasting energy. Okay? Nothing is changing here. This is where I'm going, but I'm going really slowly, ain't I? Well, there is another control. Shift by default. And when you start the game and you have research level 2, then this will take you all the way to 1000 meters per second and no further. Gravity will allow you to exceed that. If you start at 1000 meters per second and you fall towards the sun or the gas planet or your planet at that speed, it will pull you so that you will increase. The fact that it went from 1020 to 1000 
18 and now 17 means that I'm being pulled by something else as well. But now I'm centered on this planet and I've reached it. There you go. Sometimes you will enter orbit, sometimes you will just crash into it. Depending on speed I suppose or something else. You can still look around, now I am wasting energy though. So don't stay in that mode for long. E, G, Q will flip you one way, R will flip you another. But again remember that the controls for flight, not sail, because right now you are in kind of a flight. Alt to go down, space to go up. So Alt, you go down, welcome to another planet. That is how you go to another planet. And now I'm going to make it back to mine, but I'm going to use the same things. So if you think you've got it, thank you very much for watching and I hope it was, it was helpful. But I am going to try now to make it back to my original planet. Flight mode, keep pressing W, space, move off. And we are now in sail mode. Look where you want to go. I want to go to this planet, which is mine. I keep changing because I'm being pulled by orbit. I am orbiting the planet. I don't want to. I want to go there. So look at it, W. There you go. It's pulling me. There. It's again pulling me. And there. And now that should be good. Shift. For more speed. I'm gonna use now my max speed. I don't have the energy to go max speed. That's fine. Now, I need to go there. This is my planet. This is the gas giant. This is the planet. You see those little things here? They are the gravitational effects on me. They're all centered around me. But now the gas giant is starting to be dominant. Don't forget where you want to go. W, 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 focus, and there you go. See, now I didn't add orbit mode, I just crashed into it, but there's no problem. You can just do that. So I hope that teaches you how to fly.